Hello everyone and welcome to Learn Tech. In this video I'll show to you guys how you can stop automatic updates on Windows 11. The steps are pretty much the same also on Windows 10. I'll show to you guys two methods how you can stop automatic updates. One of them includes services and the other one is by including GPOs or group policies. But it's necessary only to activate one of the methods and it should stop your automatic updates. So let's go ahead and let me show you the first method how you stop the automatic updates. So we go ahead search and we type here services. Once you see the services app over here, you just click over it once in order to open. You can open services also through task manager if you want. And once you are here, you have to search for Windows update. So we scroll down till we find the service Windows update. So here we are. Here it is my Windows update. I double click on it in order to open. And as we can see, the service status is running, which means that updates are automatically installed in my computer. I'll stop automatic updates. And once it's stopped, then we need to change the startup type. So we need to go and make this disabled. So once we make the startup type disabled, we click over apply and we try to stop it once again because it's running once again. Here we are now, it's not trying anymore to start it because I have disabled. The next thing that you need to do is to go over this tab here, recovery. So we click over there and now we need to change this. So if the service is failing, the computer will try to restart the service, but I'm gonna choose take no action because I don't want this service to retry to start. I need to do this for all the other failures. So I need to choose take no action for all of them. And then I choose apply. Then I click over okay. So now let's go back once again to Windows update and let's try it again. So if we click over retry all, check in for updates. And as we can see, updates failed. So we could not complete the install because an update service was shutting down, which we actually just did. So practically you have stopped the updates on your Windows 11 computer. The next method that you may need to apply in case that this method doesn't work is to use group policies. We go over search and we type here group policy. Then it will show edit group policy. You just click over it in order to open. Once you have opened group policy, you need to go over administrative templates. You, you double click over it in order to open. And then we double click once again to Windows components. And now it will open a lot of other components of Windows, but we are interested about Windows update. So we double click over Windows update and now it's showing some other folders. It may look a little bit different, the folders that are under Windows Update, depending on which version of Windows 11 you are using. But you just have to open all the folders till you find this setting, which is named Configure Automatic Updates. In my case, it's under Manage End User Experience. You may find it directly under Windows Update, but it may be also under this folder, Manage End User Experience. You double click over it in order to open all the settings. And as we can see over here on the right, there is this setting, which is called Configure Automatic Updates. We double click on it, and now we need to disable this settings. So we choose Disabled, and then we click over apply. Here you have the description. What does that mean in case that you disable, etc., etc. But in our case, I just want to disable automatic updates on my computer. So once you disable, you press apply and then OK, and then you are good to go. We can retry once again to make sure that it's not working for sure. And here we are. Uh, Windows updates have failed and the computer cannot install Windows 11 updates. So basically these were two methods how you can permanently block Windows updates on Windows 11. You just need to apply one of these methods and it should stop the updates of Windows 11. That's all that I wanted to show to you guys. I hope you liked this video and please do not forget to subscribe and leave your comments below. Thank you.